I'm Chris from American Rotary, the world's leader in face greater technology. Every day at American Rotary, our team gets hundreds of calls asking questions about phase converters. So we wanted to take just a moment today and talk about the top five things that you should know before buying a phase converter. Number one, we think that uh, you should make sure you have enough single phase power. This is something that we run into all the time where customers just don't know what it takes to run a phase converter and it's a big question and it should be a big concern for you. So we have a formula here that tells you how to calculate out what you're going to need on single phase. If you take your three phase amps of your load, multiply that by 1.6, you're going to get your single phase amps. You multiply that by 1.2, that's 20% above what your load is, and you're going to get your required single phase amps with a 20% adder. Why do we calculate in that 20% adder, you ask? Well, the reason why we do it is most cities, they require you to have 20% you know, above what your load is. So we just build that in there as a little bit of a cushion for you. Um, number two, understand your load. You have a light load, medium load, or heavy load. To give you a little idea what that looks like, a light load would be a drill press, a table saw, a medium load would be your CNC machines, and a heavy load would be your HVAC, your air compressors, refrigeration, and stuff like wide belt sanders that take a really long time to get up and going, and they're, they're hard on your equipment. Number three, the size of your load. When you call in asking about a phase converter, we're going to need you to tell us your horsepower, your amps, your kilowatts, so that we can calculate out what would be the best phase converter for you. As a rule of thumb, you want to go two to one. So two times the size of your load will give you the size of the phase converter that you're going to need. Number four, indoor or outdoor. We want to make sure that you're protecting your phase converter. And at American Rotary, we offer an array of solutions for you, indoor or outdoor. Maybe it's metalworking and you're having metal shavings or coolant that's affecting your phase converter. Or maybe you're in a woodworking environment and you have a lot of sawdust. Maybe you're outdoor on a farm and you got wind, rain, snow. We want to make sure that we have the best phase converter for you and uh, to make sure that we're protecting not only your equipment, but uh, your phase converter as well. Number five. Who are you buying your phase converter from? Make sure that you're buying your phase converter for somebody that's reputable. We get hundreds, thousands of calls a year from people who bought one from somebody that made one in their garage and it's not working right and they have no service. At American Rotary, we have 24-7 support. We have an American-made product. We're available 365 days a year because we know that you, our customer, needs us to be. Thanks for joining me today. We really appreciate you taking a few minutes to watch this video. And if you have any other questions, you can reach us at www.americanrotary.com or sales at americanrotary.com. Thank you and have a great day.